So, not made out of bread, but made out of these big babies. What These are cucumbers. I'll just run you through the ingredients we have. Tatsoi, fresh from Clint's garden at the retreat here. And um, sweet leaf. We got sweet leaf and um, oh, we'll get into that in a moment. Black Russian tomatoes. Oh yeah. They're beautiful. Cherry tomatoes from the garden. Dill from the garden. And um, some cos lettuce that we can use for wraps. Let's start by peeling this big baby. And we've got some mango here too, which have been falling on our heads. So with this cucumber, you can make um, yeah, a variety of things. Like you can put in the sauce, like I've got a sauce here. It's got cucumber, cherry tomato, black Russian tomato, mango, dill, and that's it. That's all you need. Low fat. Low fat, great digestion. So if anyone has any questions while I'm going along, feel free to ask. No, I'm not because um, it's really, it's a bit fat. Yeah. You can spiralize Poor it. Poor cucumber. <laughs> no, it's going to it's gonna get its skin peeled off instead. We stand up for animal rights. What about vegetable rights? <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm just going to continue cutting me. So, it's like, you know, you can do heaps of low-fat raw vegan. It doesn't have to be just mono meals. Mono meals are best for digestion. Um, but you know, like once in a while doing recipes isn't going to kill you. <laughs> so you can make it fun. You can go and buy like Giuliano's book or something like that. And you know, it's just, you got about a hundred yeah. ingredients. Yeah. Yeah. And then like it says, refer to page 26 for the sauce, which has another hundred, <laughs> which can be just too much, yeah. you know. And your digestion suffers as well, so. Um, okay, you can also make pasta with the cucumber so how I did that was um, just peeling over and over fettuccine strips pasta with no digestion disaster yeah that's right <laughs> <laughs> this is all well combined too they all go well the cucumber on steroids there's a different variety of cucumber <laughs> oh, yeah, it on is. No. <laughs> oh it is on steroids that's the, that's the no it's not on steroids it's what, what is it strictly called? speaking a, a cucumber it is a fruit, yeah. Melon family. Yeah, low sugar fruit. Nice melon. Okay, so if someone likes to run to the kitchen and blend this for me, that would be great, Ryan. Thanks. Do we have a volunteer? Yeah. We have a volunteer. Thank you, Ryan. Great fruit. Ryan, I've got a banana. <laughs> and like, you can really make it look beautiful. And like, you can really make it look beautiful. And you can throw like raw food um, picnics for your, your cook food friends. Um, so with the tatsoi, you can just get it and thank you. Just get it and chop it up. It's better if you have like um, a ceramic knife instead of metal too, but we don't have one at this stage. Have some sweet lip over so here. these tomatoes, I'm going to cut up to go on our, our bread, our raw bread. With me, we were tomato fiends in Kofangan, Thailand. We found an organic store that had Better. cherry tomatoes. I'll get those and cherry tomatoes and mash them under my foot in the concrete. So these are better than those cherry tomatoes. <laughs> yeah. But they're pretty good though. Special tomato. Um, a little bit of mango. <laughs> it's fun food. Fun, tasty food. Okay, I think we need more so, filling so than that. Do you make this sort of food all the time for your boyfriend? You must be a lucky guy. <laughs> <laughs> I do actually. <laughs> no way. No, he, he gets it quite a bit. <laughs> but I prefer mono. That'd be equivalent to about 50 Big Macs. So Big Macs about 500 calories. 50 of those for one? Big Have it in terms of living. 25 Big Macs, sorry. 
a 20, 25 of these at, one big Mac. <laughs> at 20 calories each would be equivalent to one Big Mac at 500 calories. Okay, some sauce on the pasta. Mm, yum, fresh. Just like grandma used to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Chunky pasta. And then you can put like a, the decoration purposes, like the dill and <laughs> cherry tomatoes. Isn't that pretty? Oh, isn't that beautiful? Raw bread. It's bread without the um, stomach pain. Mm. <laughs> without the glue when it gets in your stomach. That looks great. Can you see that? Yeah, hold it up maybe. A little bit of sunlight on it. Ah. Slip slide. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So we're all going to get a um, taste test, huh? Do you need a volunteer for that? Yeah, okay. Up you come, George. Yeah. <laughs> Give me the first. Great <laughs> save the volunteer. Nice. Juicy. Get it on film. Yeah. <laughs> See how much mm. water content is in that? It's so mm. hydrating. It's so good for you. Chicken on the ground. <laughs> delish, delish. Thank you. Awesome. So, yeah, that's pretty much how you do it. That's it, so I'll make a whole bunch for everyone, they can come around and, and try it.